Welcome back to the Prep Pigskin Report. That was Allie Wagner at this morning's Alarm Clock Pep Rally, the Scripps Ranch custodian about to call the police, I suspect, because Allie's still on campus. She joins us now with photographer Mark Mellinger, joining us via Sputnik 7 Man Pack technology. Allie, take it away, please. Now, the custodian probably would have kicked me out, except for you think the pep rally was crazy. The game was even crazier. Scripps Ranch hosting Morse. Both teams looking for their first win of the season. Let's roll the highlights. The cage all fired up for the first home game of the season, babies included. First quarter, Scripps Ranch, Zachary Pedroza with the 12-yard touchdown pass to Cameron Breckenridge. 7-0 Falcons. Fast forward to the third, Tigers DeAnthony Walcott with the four-yard score. Two-point conversion, no good. 7-6 Falcons lead. Fast forward now to the fourth quarter. Scripps leading 9-6. Morse driving, less than a minute remaining. Jashante Spawn, screen pass to David Lewis who slices through the defense for the score. Morse takes the lead 12-9 with 15.4 seconds remaining. Last chance for the Falcons on their own 35-yard line. Sophomore QB Kyle Mullen scrambling, finding a wide open Jay Newman Leo Womb for the game winning score. Falcons win it the final 16 12. Afterwards, we spoke with QB Kyle Mullen. What went through your head? Uh, we're going to win this one finally. <laughs> After like long game, not moving ball that much, that much, we finally did it. That was insane. That was the best one ever. Uh, only a couple seconds left. I'd do what I had to do. <laughs> Get open. <laughs> Absolute thriller here at Scripps Ranch. Man, uh, we do have an injury update. Starting quarterback Zachary Pedroza, he was hurt early on in the game. Looked like a separated shoulder. We wish him all the best. But all in all, an amazing game by both teams. Pretty good one out here at Scripps Ranch. Stephanie Kelly, what do you have going on out east?